Good evening. It's a story that continues to unravel. A Terre Haute man sits behind bars accused of knowingly spreading HIV for more than a decade. Tonight, we're learning more about that man and those who say they are his victims. News 10's Lindsay Yates brings you an exclusive interview. Isaiah Binford is accused of inflicting what many would consider their worst nightmare. And several women say that nightmare has become the reality. And now one woman, whom we're calling Victim A, is stepping out of the shadows. And while she's hiding her identity, she doesn't hold back on her story. He was a really charming man, um, very handsome, seemed to be a, a loving, caring guy. Words she says are now not as fitting for this man in handcuffs. He's a monster. It's like looking at a lost, empty soul. But there was a time when she described Isaiah Benford as the man she loved. He just never seemed to be that evil. But it was towards the end of their five-year relationship. I got to where I wasn't feeling too good. A trip to the hospital would reveal. He had given me HIV. A positive diagnosis that would turn her life and that of her children upside down. I feel like I've been robbed of my life. When confronted, Benford never admitted his status. That's why she's leading the charge for justice. The only thing we did wrong was lie down with somebody who we thought loved us. Benford faces a slew of charges, all related to intentionally spreading HIV to several women for more than a decade. And victim A says she'll do what she can to make sure it comes to an end. To show him the funny games have stopped. You cannot keep playing God. You are not God. Only God tells you when it's your time. More victims recently came forward. Benford now faces 22 charges in the case. He is expected back in court in December. For the entire interview of this woman, head to our website, WTHITV.com.